normally in my videos i focus on the animals tell you stories about the jungle and uh, kind of restrict myself only to that aspect of travel right but travel is so much more it's, it's the people you meet it's the things you see it's also the stories you hear so this time i'm not going to talk just about the forest but some of the other interesting aspects of bandavgarh the bandavgarh the name itself right the story is that lord ram gifted this fort to lakshman once they came back from lanka and that's where the name bandavgarh comes from there is a fort deep inside the forest so let's explore some of these softer aspects in our jungles i'm swanand paranspe and welcome to jungle pratham first stop is to a temple called the jwalamukhi temple which is around 11 kilometers from bandavgarh and this is a 2500 year old temple the old structure was really amazing it was smaller than i anticipated but really beautiful wonderful carvings look incredibly detailed the only flaw i believe is that they have tried to integrate this with the new structure and it looks really shabby to be honest the the old structure has completely lost its charm because of it being in this kind of the modern uh, you know temple structure so i think that this they could have had better ways to preserve this particular temple but nonetheless uh, it was a really unique find on day 1 of this bandavgarh adventure This is how you celebrate opening day in the jungle. It's the 1st of October and that's why you find a lot of fun and frolic around. The gates beautifully decorated. Everyone's here waiting to start the grand opening of this season of uh, safaris into the jungle. We also have a celebrity. We have Dolly Chaiwala who's become really famous recently uh, on this safari. He also crashed one of my photos when i was trying to capture a tiger in the background the tiger here is steve and i have made a completely separate video just focusing on him so do check it out in case you haven't seen it now i went on three safaris uh, during this visit to bandavgarh now the sightings were just about okay i mean better than i had anticipated since it's just the start of the season and generally you don't know where the tigers are the leopards are where the animals are where they are normally spotted since you need to search everything from scratch but all in all it went pretty well now you would have seen many of these animals already in my earlier videos so do mention in the comments in case you don't know the names of any of them now this is what i was waiting for ever since i decided to go to bandavgarh i miss seeing this the last time i was in bandavgarh do check out this video from a year back when i visited this forest but this time i wanted to make sure that i see this sheshaya now this is a statue of lord vishnu in the sleeping position and i had been waiting to see it in person Hey guys so this is the first time i'm seeing the statue of lord vishnu it's around 30 feet it's it's blown my mind it's in the middle of a, of the jungle and it's right near the bandavgarh fort so the bandavgarh fort is up that hill okay you can only visit there twice in a year and uh, this is the statue I, i've seen this in a lot of internet sites right uh, i've seen this in on websites i've seen some people sharing photos of this but the proportion of this has really blown my mind it is it is it is massive 
It's massive and the fact that it has survived for so long, I can't believe it. Now, if you notice very carefully, you will see a shivling right next to the statue of Lord Vishnu. And to the right of Lord Vishnu, there was a statue of Brahma as well. But that statue has been destroyed by nature. Now, if you know any of the mythological stories, it's said that there can never be a statue or temple of Lord Brahma. So folks, that's it from the jungles of Bandavgad. I want to visit Bandavgad again. I want to go to the fort when it is open. There are statues of all the Vishnu avatars in the fort. They say that sometimes you can spot tigers in the fort. So sounds like a very interesting place, but it's only open two days in a year. So hopefully next time I'm able to make it and bring you more stories from this beautiful forest. Thanks for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel Jungle Pratham. Explore more jungles with us.